Epic singing about Captain Underpants, the Captain Underpants theme song from the first epic movie. That's, that was what it's called, Captain Underpants, the first epic movie. And it was epic, and it was fun. And those books are awesome, in my humble opinion. I'm Kenny. It's the weekend. It's the Animal Farm. So in just a little bit, we are actually going to talk again to a groundhog. You know, Groundhog Day coming up next week. We're, we're gearing up for it. We're excited. Maybe in early spring. That would be awesome. But right now, we're going to have a conversation with our official Animal Farm storyteller. He's going to lay it on you. Yes, bringing you another uh, probably perfectly good folk or fairy tale that he tends to mix up and maybe mess up a little bit. But it's usually to a successful effect. Please welcome our official Animal Farm storyteller with a special guest today, Uncle Luigi is in the house. Hey, Kenny, how you doing? Hey, hey boys and girls, it's me, your old pal, Uncle, Uncle Luigi. Luigi. I'm yep. the official Animal Farm storyteller. Indeed you are. And there has been a slight change in today's program, King. What do you mean a change? What change? Uh, yeah, well, we was going to tell the story of Goldilocks and the three bears, but uh, we, we, we don't what have happened? a Goldilocks. Oh, no, what happened? See, absolutely, Mindy was uh, supposed to do it, but, uh, yeah. you know, she got grounded again. So, oh. you know, what are you going to do? Yeah, okay. So well, we had to, uh, to get a substitute. What kind of a substitute? A pig. A pig? Yeah, you know, the notorious P.I.G., Oh, no, 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 yeah, no, 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 wait a minute. he said he was no. going to fill in for absolutely The need. Notorious P.I.G. is filling in for Goldilocks? That is correct. He's I, the Notorious P.I.G. Uh -huh. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You guys, we can't have a rap star playing the part of Goldilocks, okay? I'm sorry, it's just not going to work. No, 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 not a rap star. What do you mean? Not a rap. Oh. I do rhyming verse. Right, okay, whatever. The I point. am big pentameter. Okay, fine, it's still the same okay, thing. Okay, okay, thank you, Mr. Payton. Thank okay. you. Okay. Yes, <clears throat> all right. Yeah, yeah, okay, so, that's what are we gonna do? We're gonna tell you the story of a hammy hawks and of the three bears. Starring me, the notorious P.I.G. Right, starring the notorious P.I.G. Right, okay. as hammy hawks. Thank okay. you very much. <clears throat> Sheesh, act this. Once upon a time, there were three bears that lived in the woods. There was a mama bear, a papa bear, and a baby bear. And one morning, they decided to go out for a walk while they was waiting for their breakfast to cool. They was having that oatmeal porridge stuff, you know, and you know how when it's really hot, it kind of burns the roof of your mouth. I hate that. Yeah, yeah that's okay. what they didn't want to have happen. So they went out Thank for you. a walk, and who should stumble upon their house but... A little girl, I mean, uh, a little pig yes. named Hammy Hawks. Now, Hammy Hawks was a real pig. He was rude, yes. he was selfish, he didn't friends. care about other people's property, so he just walked right into the bear's house and looked at the table and said, Well, what have we here? Hmm. There were three balls of porridge on the table. A big bowl for the papa bear, mm -hmm. a medium-sized bowl for the mama bear, mm. and a little wee bowl for the baby bear. Mm. I think I shall taste one. Hammy Hawks went up to the first bowl, the papa bear's bowl, and tasted the porridge, and he said, mm. This porridge is too hot, but I think I'll eat it anyway. Uh, <laughs> So, <clears throat> then he uh, tried the second bowl of porridge, oh, but he said, This porridge is far too cold, but I shall eat it anyway. <laughs> hey, you're not supposed to eat the porridge. Hmm? What? What do you mean? One's too hot, one's too cold. You know the story. Well, you know how food will spoil if you leave it out. I don't want to leave it lying there. I, 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 okay, right, 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 right. And then he tried... <laughs> The baby bear's bowl of porridge, and he said, Oh, this porridge is just right. And of course, he said that. <laughs> By now, Hammy Hawks was getting pretty tired. Yeah. He needed to sit down. Yeah. Probably all that eating that made him tired. I don't have to be cruel about it. So he tried the first chair that he saw. It was a big oh. chair for the papa bear, and he said, Oh, this chair is too hard. Oh, oh, oh. But the chair broke. Uh oh. So he got up <coughs> and uh, went to the second yeah. chair for the mama bear, sat down on it, and said, uh, Now this chair is entirely too soft. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh. oh. oh man, 
that was from Ikea. I'm so sorry about that. My apologies, good man. Um, oh, and then, of course, he tried the baby bear's chair. That didn't even stand a chance. Uh, uh, this chair is just right. Yeah, just right for firewood. Oh, boy. Oh. So anyway, yes, Amy Hatcher, boy. by this point, was exhausted. He went upstairs, laid down on the bed. They all broke. And finally, he just fell asleep on top of a pile of crushed lumber. And the bears came home, and they looked, and all their food was gone. All their furniture was broken. They were tired. They were hungry, and they couldn't have their porridge. So they had pork chops and bacon instead. Pork, pork chops and bacon. Um, oh, oh my, I gotta go. Bye. Uh, uh, Notorious P.I.G. signing off. Goodbye.